I do I do add value to a number of things let me give an example like a wall clock I buy it but I don't give it to my clients like that I buy it then I change it to give a better and attracting look uh, another thing I like I do mirrors so my mirrors I sell to my clients are uh, usually okay let me say unique because they have different designs on them I do add some values like put something attractive I started TI Crafts because I always wanted to be my own boss I was tired of being used so I got an idea to start up something new because I love art and I knew that I can try something new about my work I work from home and I get the materials only if I've got a client I work on orders I buy my materials from town downtown Chikubo so I only buy those materials only if I've got an order I deal in deliveries and I'm an online seller I get most of my clients from TikTok, Instagram and Facebook uh, I've been blessed in this business because even, even if I work from home I get clients uh, and the clients always come in from my phone, from my Instagram they always contact me so the, the, only, the only advice I can give any girl out there is that uh, in whichever space you are whether you're at home, whether you've got some small portion of a place in town or anywhere you can, st you can start up your own thing and it can work so what I believe that with time to come my business will grow and I will get somewhere better back home to work from because I'm inspired by most of the women, mostly women who have their old shops in places like Acacia Mall, Arena Mall. I like them. They inspire me so much to work harder so that I can get more clients, more than the ones I'm already having because I thank Jehovah so much because still I work from home. I get very good clientele and my work is really good and I enjoy it because I work from home with no pressure. Uh, my market is wide because I share with everyone my products. Uh, office, office workers get my products, homes get my products, uh, hotels also order for some. So I mostly want to get those big contracts from big hotels, from big apartments, from big offices because I customize everything like we can make frames instead of putting the other crafts I make I can put either name I can put either letter I can do exactly what my client wants I'm grateful that for my business I'm able to pay for a number of my bills not like before where I was used I had a job before I started my crafts work but now uh, in like just two orders, I can easily sum up the whole salary I was given months back before I started working for myself. And this is good from hard work, which doesn't need too much to start, but you can start with whatever you have to get what you need. And you're going to see yourself stepping ahead every day and every time through these small, small things because my business looks small. But I'm grateful to Jehovah that it has helped me with a number of things and it has helped me to be busy. I'm not the type of a person who is always there waiting for where are we going to gain the to gain the one. No, I'm always busy, I'm always having orders, and I'm always thinking of what next, what can I bring you.